Okay, so we've got the system set up now. We've got the 2CFM cordless pump with the large um, quarter to 3.8 um, high flow uh, hoses from Navtech. We've got the uh, core removal tool on the suction side with the core removed. And we've also read in the other side of the system, the tour on there uh, through the little, um, for the test of 552 micron gauge, okay? So we're gonna power it up now. We're gonna do a real time speed test to see how quickly these uh, hoses are on a, a new 10 kilowatt Fujitsu um, heat pump. Okay, all right, Neil, do you wanna fire it up, please? Eight at the pump. Um, we never use the quarter side if we can help it. Really, the quarter side on any vacuum pump was only ever there for you to fit the micron gauge on to the test if your pump will pull below 500 microns. Otherwise, you have no idea whether your pump is working or not before you actually apply it to the system. Um, obviously, the hose, the other end of the hose is a quarter inch that's connected on to the valve core removal tool because the uh, the whole idea of the high flow hoses is that we do not go through uh, cores because as you know cores uh, effectively restrict the flow rate um, by 90%. They just nigh on literally block, block the, uh, the, the pipe up, okay? So we've got 50, we've got, we've got, that's one minute and we're down to 2,600 microns. So you can see that on the video, it's a bit sunny up here. So she's absolutely ripping this thing down. And as you can see, we're on, we're actually measuring the microns um, from the opposite side of the system. So we are reading both sides uh, as you should. Okay. So well below two tall now. Time, 1.34. Pump's incredibly quiet, absolutely lovely little thing as I've shown you on previous videos. So light, the only thing that you've got to be careful of, these hoses are, um, are hefty considering the size of the pump. So you just make sure that you've got a trail that she's not tipping the pump forward. On there now she's real stable, but if you get the, the, the kink of the hose pulling against it, it can actually pull it away towards you and you don't want to be damaging the pump. If there's any doubt, you would always put the back pump on the floor, on the level surface. We can't do that here because, as you can see, we're on quite a pitch of room. But um, let's have a little recap. We're at 2 minutes 15 and we're down to 732 microns. I mean, this is incredible. This thing is an absolute um, beast of a hose. And don't forget, it's the hose that's doing this work. If all of you were still using quarter hoses going on through manifolds, it's going to take you close on 30 minutes to back the system down with such a short pipe run like this. I think I said earlier that this is a 10 kilowatt Fujitsu heat pump. Um, granted, it's only got a five meter, um, maybe six meter at most pipe run, but here we go. Well, we are 585 microns, two minutes 53 seconds. So, if nothing else, these hoses pay for themselves because they're roughly about 50 quid each. Um, they come with 3.8 on the one end, quarter on the other. The other size of hose comes with, always with quarter on, but then it would have half inch on there for the larger vacuum pumps to get that little bit more flow rate, but it's only a minute or two, but it would improve it. So here we go, we have 500 microns, three, three minutes, 20 seconds. Extraordinary, and this thing will just keep going and going as low as she can now. Okay, we're gonna knock off the test and we're gonna uh, commission the unit now.